welcome back to my channel. This is your girl Cassie, aka People and Natural, and I'm back with another video. In today's video, as you can see by the title, I am doing a flexi rod set on my hair today. As you can see, my hair is fully blown out, kind of. I got my hair straightened about three weeks ago, and it's been it's been two or three weeks now. But I got my I had put in braids, and then I took it out. And then comb down my hair so this is the result my hair is super dry right now and it's actually dirty but i'm getting my hair done in two days so i decided to record this video before that comes around so without wasting much time let's get right into the video so i picked up some products today before i got home after work i'm using the curls product and it's gonna be the goddess curls botanical jelly these are the two main products that i'm gonna be using today so yeah i'm not gonna wet my hair or anything like that i'm just gonna use this and then yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video so i'm starting off by parting my hair into sections so i can easily apply my product everywhere These are the flex rods that I'm going to be using. Now I'm going to go in with my Curl Cream Brulee Cream, which is used to define and moisturize curls without hold. It's formulated with certified organic, but the purpose of this is to moisturize your hair, enhance curls, gives the hair volume and great shine. Now I'm going to go in with the Curls Goddess Curls Botanical Jelly. It's infused with Plumaro Alba Flower Extract and Aloe Leaf Juice. It fights frizz and creates popping curls. Oh, curl. The purpose of this is holding the curls together, moisturizing the curls, and also it gives you grace enhancement. Well, the jelly is really watery, but the little goes a long way and it smells amazing. So I don't really have a specific way that I do my flexi rod sets, but I just twirl it around the, the flexi rod and you know I just repeat that over and over. I'm not a pro at this, so bear with me, you know, I'm gonna get better soon. Okay, I'm gonna bring the voice over to an end because I have nothing else to say. But I'm gonna leave you guys so you can, you can enjoy the video. So, hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. And yeah, see you in the next video. So while I'm putting this whipped cream in my hair, I was kind of expecting my hair to, the front of my hair to start, you know, reverting back. But I'm kind of not seeing it. And I'm low-key scared. I hope I didn't get heat damage because I got really happy when I touched the back. I started with the back and everything was cool. It reverted back so it was cool. But now I'm kind of like scared. Then again, the front of my hair is very loose so maybe it's going to take a while. Or I don't know, maybe I'm actually going to have to wet it with water. But I'm not doing that right now because I'm on top of that. I'm, I'm very confident that i didn't get any heat damage because I, I just know you know what i'm gonna keep doing this and i'm not gonna talk about it because i know that i didn't get heat damage and i'll be really upset if i did so let's just oh it's kind of coming back we'll see so yeah we're gonna keep going i don't know if you guys are noticing that i'm mixing the the sizes up in the back well, that's because I don't have enough um, flex rods, so I don't want to like end up having some part being too big and then other part being too tiny. So instead of just having that, I'm just going to mix them up so everything is evened out. So we're just going to keep doing this. Actually, I was just tripping, you know, my hair is fine. I didn't get any heat damage. What's heat damage? So I have a feeling my flexi rods are not gonna be enough. So this is gonna be tough, you know. I'm just gonna get them big. 
I was initially gonna use the rod set, but working with those are so freaking hard. Honestly, I got them a long time ago, like back in 2015, and I don't think I've ever used them. We have a hole here, <laughs> like basically half of it left. And I have like 10 rod sets, so flexi rods, I mean, yeah. And I see that even though I didn't put any water in my hair, it's reverted my curls back perfectly. So that's, that's good. This is so watery. Yeah, it's hella watery, but it feels good on the hair. It's not too thick on the hair. It's very Hey guys, so this is it. I'm finally done and thankfully the flexi rods was enough. I managed it and I actually have two big ones left. I kind of feel like this part is gonna come out looking a little bit crappy. Okay you guys, so I'm gonna head to sleep now. It's been a long night. I finally got this hair in this bonnet. It was smoky hurting. Probably didn't place them very well. Okay, so I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, so it's the next morning and I am about to take this down. I'm actually not going anywhere surprisingly with my face done and everything, you know? But yes, so let's take this down. Since my hair was already moisturized, I'm not gonna put any coconut oil in it. And honestly, I'm not feeling too great about this hair. I feel like it didn't turn out as good, but it's okay. So let's take this down. Hopefully they came out well. It was kind of hard go sleeping because it was too much on my head. I guess I could have put some product at the end because it looks messy at the end. Well, so far so good. I'm not seeing anything bad about the product that I use. I actually love the smell that it's giving me right now. It smells so great. So now I think we're just gonna, like I said, I'm not gonna moisturize it. I'm not gonna put any um, oil in it because it feels really moisturized. So I don't know if I should separate them. I don't wanna separate them because these curls are honestly really cute. But um, I'm gonna have to just a little bit. See how bouncy this is? This is bomb. Do y'all see this? Uh.
If you guys can see how shiny my hair is right now, but I love it. I wish I could keep this in for at least one week, but sadly I'm gonna have to comb it out tomorrow and I'm really pissed about that. Ugh. Let me zoom in so you guys can take a look at what I'm talking about right now. Okay. Wait, take a look at the shine. Like this is amazing. Look at the shine, yo. Like, I'm impressed. This is literally the most shine I have ever received in my hair. And then, mind you, before I started my hair, I didn't put any other product in it but these two. So, honestly, that's great because I was expecting to add a little bit of coconut oil, but once I took it out, I was like, I'm not gonna put any coconut oil in there. You know what? I kind of knew what this was up to, so. Y'all did that. Y'all did this, okay? This is the bomb. I'm gonna finish styling it. I'm gonna separate them a little bit. I mean, you guys already know that I don't care much for the finishing. So, well, that's for the people who has been with me for a couple of months now. So, we just, you know, I'm gonna get the volume up in. I'm just gonna fluff it out with my hands just like this. I'm just gonna keep going. Look at how it flows, look at how it moves. This is just so beautiful. So, this is the final look, you guys. Bang, bang, bang. Yep, yep, my hair looks flawless as ever so if you decide to try this please let me know how it goes and don't forget to like comment and subscribe honestly I need you guys to really comment and let me know what you would like to see on this channel I still need to do my get to know me tag all that stuff but honestly I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Just not yet. So you guys go ahead and comment whatever you want to see on this channel. What you guys, what hairstyle you want me to do with my hair. So yeah, just go ahead and comment and of course subscribe if you're not already subscribed. 